What's up, what's up, what's up? What's up, my trucker with Jazz family? I know I ain't posting a little minute. I got some videos I'm going to upload too. So guess where I'm at? If y'all seen the video, then y'all remember when I get the Hagger sound, I use the dolly yard. I use the dolly yard to exercise. So right now what I'm doing is just um, warming up, doing me a little walk. Sometimes when I get to, when I'm like in the middle of the workout, I get to lifting the dolly up a few times, working on my arms and squatting. And uh, yeah, the goal is to get this weight off. So I'm gonna just do a little talk with you guys and update you guys and see what's up. All right, so my dog is like super excited to be out the truck. I don't, I never had a dog. And I'm slowly realizing, he's like two now, and I'm like realizing that dogs get anxiety and they get overwhelmed. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, I get that they're getting used to the truck because that's all they know. But at the same time, like, I think I'd be irritated as a dog too. The owner's getting out, they're going in the casinos, they going to the movies. And yeah, he just don't got no companion. Is I'm the only one thinking like that? Oh, y'all think it like that too right now it's it's cool out too um i'm in Hagerstown, maryland and it's very cool i don't have a jacket but i feel like me walking around right now it's gonna for sure make my nose snot up <laughs> my wife drove us in so i've been in the back sleeping for most of my shift and she's like you gonna be up and i was like no I'm gonna take me a shower after I do me about 45 minutes and then I'm gonna go lay back down. Rest is the key. I get that I'm gonna get up early in the morning and drive, so I'm gonna get my rest. Yesterday, my arms was killing me cause I was lifting pretty heavy at the gym. I was lifting like 60, between 60 and 80 pounds, going back and forth between those weights, just getting my muscles used to it. Um. It's cool. I want this weight off. So, uh, I'm going to do whatever necessary. And I'm really happy that we are at Hackerstown this week, even though I don't like this run. Because I like that I can get off and have the time to walk. With my other load, I got to just keep moving. You know, I, I have to keep moving. Um, I only get to walk on my 30-minute break. And usually, it's not well lit. I see it's real lit. It's real lit. So... I feel good. You got a poop or something? I feel very good um, with doing my walk and comfortable. When you at the rest stop, you know, it's nighttime. You trying to do your business. You walking, but then you got to be very um, attentive to what's going on around you because human trafficking is real. People stalking you is real. Praying on you is real. Why you vulnerable trying to hold this camera and talk to the people. It's very dangerous. I know over here, I got to be paying attention to the, uh, you know, people coming over here. Like, this is a dolly yard, but all these dollies don't supposed to be in the middle like that. The dollies don't supposed to be in the middle, guys. Like, they all supposed to be lined up on, on this corner right here all the way down. So, whenever the yard dog people get a chance, they'll organize it. Or whoever that person is that organized will organize. I laugh because every time I come here... I get the guys that just stare at me and I be sitting here telling them like instead of staring get your ass out here and walk like you can get out and walk get out here and walk don't blow at me don't drive by me slow trying to figure out what I'm doing clearly I'm exercising right so get your ass out here and, and, and walk or something but yeah like literally every time I come here that's the response I'll record it cuz I don't want to put nobody on the spot, but it's just a little aggravating sometimes. But yeah, so um, how y'all doing? School back in for those that got kids. Y'all ready? Y'all mentally ready? Y'all happy for that little break where the kids get to go back to school and you don't got to work from home with your kids in the background? For my viewers that have that situation, I've been checking on everybody. Not on everybody because... I, I don't reach out to everybody, but I do it here. What's up? My real family I grew up with that got kids. I hope everybody good. 
for y'all for y'all that watch my videos i hope y'all doing well i hope the family doing well and yeah i don't have a load yet our load leave out maybe sometimes it'll be ready like four in the morning or sometimes it'll be ready like six in the morning so we're gonna gauge that and see i'll make sure i post in the morning what the situation is my wife parked the truck we that second bob tail from the back that that's us <laughs> um we like parking over there because usually our loaded trailers go right here and um yeah that's just what we do i'm gonna do two laps with this dog just to get him out and then i'm gonna come and put this phone down so i can power walk and really get it in and work up a sweat and don't gotta worry about him snatching on my dang arm because he like killing me with this arm snatching grants come here buddy you ready to go inside are you ready to go inside hey excuse me Prince. hello hello sir you see how you looking at the truck is he is he caring about his mama or is he just being disrespectful y'all let me know in the comments prince get from all this trash please hey prince mr prince are you trying to poop or something because i didn't call thank you i didn't call you 99 times the people want to know do you listen can we go thank you oh look clearly Let's see. I, I'm just gonna indulge him. Is he trying to use the restroom? Is he trying to get back to my wife? Or is he trying to um, just be over here doing whatever he wanna do? Clearly do whatever he wanna do, okay. Clearly do whatever he wanna mm -hmm. do. So, I'm just checking. Now I ain't in nobody's way, so I don't know why they over here blowing the horn like that. But this tractor right here, he just blew their horn. Not tractor, sorry. Damn, doc. I don't know why they over here blowing horns like that. Aggravate yourself. I was not in the way. Prince, let's go. But yeah. So, um, life been life and I'm chilling. I'm ready to go to my Tony Braxton concert in October. And, um, yeah, my dog got me turned all around. I'm ready to go to my Tony Braxton concert in October. I've been watching it because, you know, she deal with lupus and she be getting really sick and she just had like a health scare. Maybe like eight, I don't know, maybe eight to 10 months ago. So I'm hoping my concert don't get canceled and I'm hoping she, her health improves. And um, yeah, I just been waiting. So we gonna see how everything goes. But yeah, I'm just ready to get rid of this dang dog to the truck. And my wife was gonna come walk with me, but she been driving and she said she wanna eat. And then she'll come walk. Hopefully she do, but if she don't, teach his own. I'm gonna keep on walking. Y'all let me know what y'all doing. If y'all a truck driver and you doing a 10 hour break and you hear my words, get out and walk. It's essential. Get out and walk. 30 minutes ain't gonna hurt nothing. In the dog, at a truck stop. It's lit enough. Get out and walk. Please. Like, I, I really got to get back to doing my videos where we get out and walk. Because we really do. It's imperative. Like, it's imperative. Prince, this way. It's imperative. Um, health day. Not, like, you can't drive this damn truck if you ain't got no help. Now, I know y'all may say, Jasmine, we didn't heard this before. Well, I'm going to keep saying it again. All right? You can't do nothing without your help. All right? Don't wait till it's too late. Don't wait till it's too late for them to tell you you got something. When if you was already proactive, maybe you could have been already working on that something they could have been telling you about. You get what I'm saying? Maybe you don't got to get that bad news. Don't wait. We know better, so let's do better. But yeah, it's a lot of movement right now, so I'm going to stop with my dog. Fritz, right up, you guys. Because they, they thinking I don't see them, but I see them. Y'all tell me, is that uh 10 miles per hour flying in this um damn area? But that's what we're supposed to be doing, 10 miles per hour. But clearly they going 
faster than 10 miles per hour. I wish I had a speed gun so we could see. But yeah, it's straight. Y'all have a happy, blessed Monday. It's been 10 minutes. I'm going to get off this thing because a sister girl got to get her walk in. And I just want to encourage you guys to keep on doing what you need to do to get where you want to be. For those that are on their shit, keep it up. For those that need to start, don't wait until it's too late. You can start one day. One day make a difference. If you got life, get your ass up and do something. All right? If you got a business you want to do, stop contemplating about it. If you're trying to figure out how you're going to do it, what the finances look like, call them down financial advisors at them banks. That's what they're here for. Let them look at your finances, what you're bringing in. Let them show you the goal. In six months, look, this is what needs to accumulate. In a year, this is what needs to get down. And let's work on the plan, guys. Stop playing. In my new year, I'm ready to go back. I'm ready to go back. Me and my wife, we ready to get our truck. We've been contemplating, and now it's time. November gonna make three years as a CDL driver. I ain't waiting till I'm, I ain't waiting 20, 30 years to not realize that I should get a truck. No. Plan without a vision ain't nothing. You gotta know and see where you wanna be. You have some ideas. Don't think that because you dreaming is too far away. Or that's not reasonable. Other people's dreams don't got to be your dreams. And don't let other people's expectations or failures set you up to be like, you can't do it. Nah, don't be like that. Don't be foolish. Don't be foolish. What they plan was, they, it could be the same damn business. It maybe ain't meant for them. Some people copy and want other people's goals. It ain't meant for them. You got to see it as what it is. Maybe they ain't good at the follow through. It could have been their dream. It could have been what they supposed to do, but they ain't doing what they supposed to do. But don't let they, I mean, they failures. I mean, learn from them, especially if they putting it out there. But outside of that, like make sure that you setting up for you and you putting your 150% in. And don't let nobody sit here and tell you what you can't have and can't do. Nah, we ain't with all that. See, my nose getting stuffy. So I got my dolphin. Dolphins, yeah. I had to just hit on that. We got a game this Friday. I know it's preseason, but I mean, I'm just saying. Dolphins, where y'all at? Miami, Florida, where y'all at? I surely got my jacket on the truck. Friday come, I'm gonna be lit. I left my jersey home. I ain't gonna lie, guys. I left my jersey home. Um, I got two. I got Tannehill, and then I got a new quarterback. All right, and uh. I ain't remember before I left out which day the game was going to be on because I was like, on the road, I'm going to wear this dang jersey, right? And I wind up wearing a jacket, bringing a jacket. But I'm telling y'all, Dolphins loaded. Where y'all at, bro? Where y'all at? I'm telling y'all, y'all throw down y'all team in the comments. If y'all got this far in the video, like, thank you guys so much so for y'all support, for real, for real. But, you know, let me know who y'all team is. Let let me know what the team is. What 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 is the team? You going for y'all drop down who y'all think gonna be over there fighting in the, in the in the playoffs? Come on, February, y'all let me know. I'm I'm throwing dolphins in there. I know we always the wild card, but I'm throwing us in there because baby, we that defense ain't nothing to play with. I don't care that defense ain't nothing to play with. I I I don't know what the owners doing. Why they playing around? Why we don't be winning? Like we be winning games, but why we don't be getting to that championship? I don't know what be going on in the background. I don't know who paying who off. But something going on. But I love my dolphins. I just had to put it out. I mean, look, my auntie, give it up to my auntie. Rest in peace, man. She already, she always says she the number one dolphin hater. And I couldn't understand. I was like, why she just hate the dolphins? I mean, I never even rep the dolphins because she hated the dolphins so much. But baby, I rep it now. I, the auntie, I'm sorry. I rep it now. But y'all have a happy Monday. Um, y'all be blessed for today ain't even Monday. Look at me. A happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday, guys. Like, yeah, happy Tuesday. See, I'm all off. I'm the night driver, so I'm all off. <laughs> look, look at my dog. He ready to go. You ready to go, babe? Come on. Bang! 
All right, y'all stay blessed. We'll catch y'all later. I'm out.